right, y'all, I have some chopped up zucchini here. That's good. Yeah, all right, I have this eight by eight bacon dish. And then grape tomatoes, right on top. We done, I'm just kidding. <laughs> what if that was it, y'all? Would y'all still watch me? All right, now I have some extra virgin olive oil. So we're gonna just pour this on top. Um, a few tablespoons, I don't know. Okay, guess what we doing now, y'all? We mixing. We're using our best kitchen utensils and we're gonna mix this all together, all right? So we just have some grape tomatoes cut in half and some zucchini I cut up as well. Very easy, all right, y'all? So we're just gonna give this a good mix to make sure the olive oil is spread all over these. And you know what, y'all? Olive oil is good for your hands. So there we go, a little moisturizer. All right, um, now we're also gonna add here a little bit of garlic, um, about that much. A little bit of garlic right on top. We're also gonna season this. So I'm doing um, a little bit of pink salt, like so and a little bit of black pepper, but this is gonna be real hard to do because my hands are greasy from that olive oil. <laughs> so I'm using this pepper in instead this time, black pepper. All right, and then we also gonna put in here um, a little bit of basil. I don't know, a few leaves, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna rip it apart. Y'all can chop it if you want, but you know how I, you know how I like to do stuff, all right, y'all? So this is a quick, this is an easy, delicious meat. I mean, y'all can eat this as a meal or as a side dish, but it's two steps, it's very easy. So we're just gonna give this a little mix. I mean, what the heck, at this point, psh, might as well just use my hands again, all right? So just zucchini, tomatoes, salt, pepper, garlic, and I think that's all I put in here, but I can't remember at this point. All right, y'all, so we're just gonna put this in the oven. I'm gonna cover this with a piece of foil. First, I'm gonna wash my hands though. And I'm gonna put this in the oven at 350 for about, um, about 15 minutes. And then we have one more step. All right, y'all, so while uh, our zucchini and tomatoes are starting to cook, we're gonna make the topping. So I have this Italian style uh, breadcrumbs, but y'all can use whatever kind of breadcrumbs you want, all right? So I put about, I don't know, about a half a cup in there. To this, we are going to add um, about a cup of Parmesan cheese. Um, I don't know, that, that might've been more than a cup, but that's all right. And then we also add in a little bit of basil. I know we already have some basil with the vegetables, but I like to put a little bit more fresh basil. I think it's real good. If y'all want to chop it up, you can, but you know what? I'm using I'm using what my mama gave me, my hands, right here, y'all, my favorite kitchen tools, and my second favorite kitchen tool, my trusty fork. So we're just gonna give this a little mix, and uh, I kinda wanna use my hands, but I'm not going to because, yes I am, I'm just kidding. What, what am I talking about? I'm using my fork, my trusty fork, and my hands, all right. So we're just gonna mix this a little, and um, then we're gonna take our, I'm gonna show y'all what we're gonna do next, but this will be the topping for our zucchini and tomato delicious dish. All right, y'all, so this was cooking for 15 minutes. We just wanna start getting those zucchini a little soft. So now what we're gonna do here, we have, um, we have some Italian style cheese blend. So I'm gonna put a little bit of this right on top, like so. And then um, just a little bit, because we, we have that top and we, go, we made. And then what we're gonna do here, we're just gonna give this a little mix. Just a little bit, you know what? It's, yeah, just to mix everything around. I mean, it already looks real good though, y'all, real good. All right, looks great. So now what we're gonna do is, we're gonna take our mixture. This is our breadcrumb and cheese and basil mixture, and we're just gonna put this right on top, all right? A nice layer right on top. Oh, y'all, this is gonna be so good. All right, here we go. All right, y'all, so now what we're gonna do, we're just gonna put this in the oven and let it cook on 350 um, for about 20 minutes. All right, y'all, so here's our zucchini tomato bake. So y'all, this is great. Um, if you just wanna eat like a vegetable dinner, it's a great side dish, serve it with some chicken. You can even serve this over pasta and it would be delicious. So we're just gonna try it like it is. Um, y'all, I've been cooking all day. All my dishes are dirty, so I'm using this thing, all right? It works, whatever works, that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna take this out, all right. So that looks real good, real colorful. Zucchini, tomatoes, basil, Italian cheese blend. And uh, that's it, we are gonna try some now. So uh, yeah, this, this I think I took this out of the oven a while ago. So I'm gonna get a zucchini. I'm gonna get some cherry tomato. It smells real good actually. All right, y'all, let's do this, okay. I'm trying to get stuff on my fork. This just ain't working. So guess what? I'm just kidding. Okay, <laughs> here we go, y'all. Mmm, mmm, mmm. 